You're listening to The Topcast, the original podcast for growth-minded instrumental music and voice teachers since 2015, with your host, Tim Topham. Our mission at Top Music is to empower instrumental music and voice teachers to find and nurture their innate creativity so that they can teach lessons that are innovative, integrated, and inspiring, and that will have a positive lifelong impact on their students. Join us each week as we interview teachers and creators from around the world and unpack fun and exciting ideas to maximize your teaching and studio business success. Hi there, teachers. It's Tim here. Welcome back to the TopCast. Great to be with you for another episode. This one's a relatively short episode, but very, very important because I want to explain to you what's coming up, a really important event that I would love for you to come along to. It's a brand new workshop that I've been working on for, well, actually, probably for 14 years, really. The content of this is the culmination of all the work that I've been doing with teachers since we started back in 2010. But specifically, I've been working on this for the last few months, and I'm really excited to bring it to light. It's called The Six Cores of Music Teaching and Studio Business Success. Discover where to focus your time and energy for maximum impact. Do you ever feel overwhelmed thinking about everything that you have to do when running your studio? Juggling the scheduling, billing, parents, selecting repertoire, recitals, exam preparation, concerts, research, professional development, and of course, that's all on top of finding the time to look after your own family, spend quality time with your partner, catch up with your friends, have a social life, exercise, maintain a healthy diet. Do you ever wonder how you do it all? And perhaps you're struggling a little bit and not doing it all. More importantly, do you ever wonder if you have to be doing all of that? All of this is especially overwhelming when you're doing a lot of it manually, things like scheduling, collecting payments, and general business administration. Just a quick aside tip, if you're still using spreadsheets, invoices, and notepads, you are wasting a lot of time, and you've got to come along to this workshop. When you're so involved in your business, it can be hard to get perspective on what you actually need to do and what you're just doing because you think you should. After working with thousands of teachers since 2010, we've realized something. Studio success is determined by six core fundamentals. Now, you can work on other things, but these fundamentals offer you the most value, the most bang for your buck for the time that you've got, and everybody's time is limited, isn't it? When I think about how little time I have in amongst the family and the kids and all the things that I have to do, we want to make sure that the work that we're doing is has maximum efficiency, and that's what we're talking about. So back in 2023, we put this theory into practice over 12 weeks with a cohort of 30 studio owners. And we can confidently say that these six core fundamentals are the key to maximum success in your studio teaching and your business. So this is talking about the pedagogy, the how of of your teaching and the what you teach, and also the business side of running your studio. So how do we know? How are we so sure of this? Well, Here's just three super quick examples. Within six months after the completion of the 12-week program, Sue grew her studio by 25% and is now working one day less. Get that? Listen again. One day less, but has grown her studio by 25%. Beth gained 10 students growing from 30 to 40 in her studio and is now planning to change the group, which is what she was hoping to do all along. And Tiffany, who was a completely new teacher to teaching, she'd come from corporate and was getting back into teaching and she grew her studio numbers from 3 to 13 straight after this program. And the impact on their pedagogy was huge too. The confidence gained, the experience in regards to all different aspects of their pedagogy, and we're talking about multiple instruments here too, was really profound. Now, as you know, it's easy to spend hours on unnecessary things, hours that you could be spending with your loved ones. And look, let's be honest, it's easy to spend hours on your latest Netflix show too, right? Don't worry, I get sucked in as well. (laughs) But when you work out which of the six cores are your strongest and which your weakest, everything becomes clearer. You know where you should be spending your time. So you no longer tirelessly work on unneeded jobs and projects and grab for every new shiny object that comes your way. Instead, you create your own roadmap to determine where to focus your time and energy for the highest impact. And this is super helpful for those falling into that overwhelming feeling with the amount of information out there. All of the new ideas that come to you that you get in your inbox and that you see online and you see videos of, it's really hard to know what is the most important and that's what we're doing. And also just keep in mind, the six cores aren't just for teachers wanting to grow their studio. And they're not all about business either. In fact, three cores are about pedagogy and three are about business. 
But whether you're just starting out on your teaching journey or you've been teaching for decades, out of that uh, initial cohort of 30, we had people just beginning and people who've been teaching for 30 years or more. And whether you're happy with just keeping to five students and working from home or whether you want 500, the six cores will help you wherever you want to get to and wherever you're starting. So you're probably wondering, what are the six cores and which core is my weak point? So what I want you to do is join me for a special one hour free live workshop session that's coming up. I'm going to be guiding you through the six cores step by step. I'm going to unpack what they are and reveal how they can open up exciting new opportunities for you, for your teaching and your studio business. Now, this is a workshop and I've distinctly called it that rather than a webinar. So, we're going to be sharing with you a short two-page document, which I'm going to be getting you to complete during the training. This is a really practical training. It's about engagement, it's about interactivity, and it's about getting some work done. So, what I want you to do is commit to coming along for the hour, being prepared to take action and share and contribute and stay focused. Great opportunity to tell the family that the door stays shut and no one can interrupt you for that next hour. Now, I also realize that we're all in different time zones, so I'm actually going to run this live, a repeat of it, on two occasions coming up to cover as many different people as possible so that we can have maximum live engagement. So, when you head to the page I'm going to link you to in just a second, you'll see there's a button to click for one of the time zones or you can click the button for the other one. So, these are on Tuesday the 11th of June and I'm running one at 12 p.m. Melbourne time which is about 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern time. So this is going to be good if you're in Western Australia, Australia, Asia, or the United States or New Zealand. And then I'm going to be running an evening one in Australia, which tends to work really well. It's midday in the UK. It's great if you're in Hong Kong or Singapore, it's 8 p.m. And if you're an early riser in Eastern time zone America, or very early riser in Central time zone, you could meet me at about 7 a.m. Eastern. So all the information you need, and the link to sign up is at topmusic.co slash workshop. So register now to secure that spot. It'll be super cool to see you. We will email you a link so you get that two-page handout. Make sure you print it, grab a pen and a highlighter, bring those along, and uh, we're going to have an amazing time. It's going to be super fun. Yes, there's a little bit of work to do, but I'm going to make it as enjoyable as possible. As you know, all my online trainings are really enjoyable and hopefully really eye-opening for you. And yes, we will have replays, but again, as Try and get along to the live if you possibly can because it's going to be really instructive for you. So it's topmusic.co slash workshop. So that's it from me today. I really hope you can come and join us at the workshop. It's in about one week's time if you're listening to this around about its publication date. It's going to be a great opportunity to connect with other teachers and also really unpack what is most important for you in your studio and your teaching to make the most of the time that you have, to make the most of the success that you deserve and also just to make sure that you're using your time really, really productively because we all have limited time on this planet, right? <laughs> we want to make sure we're using it to the best of our ability and to maximum effect. Can't wait to share that with you. Until next week, I'm Tim Topham and you've been listening to The Topcast. Speak to you again soon. How do you keep up to date with all the latest trends and research into music education? How do you connect with other teachers around the world and make sure your teaching stays fresh and relevant for students of all ages and stages both now and into the future? I created our Top Music Pro membership to be the one-stop shop for music teaching resources, training, support and community and I'd love for you to come and join us inside. With over 40 comprehensive training courses, hundreds of teaching demonstrations and lesson plans, free monthly sheet music, discounts, and all the business and pedagogy support you could ever need, Top Music Pro is the community you've been looking for. If you're ready to level up your learning from the podcast and join thousands of other teachers in our global network, head over to topmusicpro.com today. If you enjoy this show and want to hear more of our work, be sure to subscribe to this podcast wherever you're listening today. For links and resources mentioned in this episode, visit us at topmusic.co slash podcast or check out the show notes. I'm Tim Topham. Thank you so much for listening. Enjoy your week ahead and I'll catch you next time.